be sure to cook. Welcome back to another show of Be Sure to Cook. Today, we're doing fried fish. So let's do this. Stay tuned. So right now, I've got some yellow cornmeal. Then I'm gonna start adding seasons to this cornmeal. So I'm gonna use a teaspoon of seasoning salt. I'm gonna do a teaspoon of wonderful paprika. H half teaspoon of the Mrs. Dash blend. I told y'all guys, I use that on everything. Once again, garlic powder. And this is also a, a teaspoon of garlic powder. I'm gonna do a, a whole tablespoon. A te half teaspoon of dry mustard. I got some cracked black pepper. And a whole tablespoon of Obey. And I'm just gonna mix all this up. Okay, I've got my pan getting hot, and I'm just gonna pull about, maybe that's about a cup of grease. Okay. Do a couple pieces like this. If you got any bones on the side of your fish, because Whitey can't get bones, and sometimes they deflate, I mean, they uh, debone, but they don't do a good job. But I don't mind. See me, there's a little bones right here. But when they cook and get crispy, you can eat those. But I don't mind, but if you do, just discard all the bones. If you have no bones in the fish, you just around the edges of the fish. Put these sides down. And these are the fillet, fillets that I have gotten. I've got about four of these, I think. I'm gonna start off with, with the skin side down. And I'm gonna fry these babies up, and we'll see what they look like. Okay, once you see, if you look here, once you start seeing the nice gold brown on the edges, and that's when we're gonna start flipping your fish. See? See, and I'm talking about the gold edges there. Now, it's, I'm doing a pan fry, but actually, I usually do a deep fry. But if you're frying a lot of fish, then you wanna deep fry, since I'm not frying a lot of fish, I want to pan fry this because if I pan fry the fish, I'm not wasting a lot of grease. Now I'm going to be taking these fishes out, but that's what it's going to look like. Good fried fish. Look at that. That looks delicious. I'm just frying up the back a little bit more because I like a little crunch. A little bit more crunch. We're going to plate these fish up. Okay guys, we plated up the fish. Sprinkle a little parsley on top. Try to make it look appealing and appetizing, and it's so good. Ain't nothing like hot, fresh whitey. This is called whitey. Oh, we always called it whitey because, you know, we got that slang, but it's whitey. Filets, beautiful, prepared, and it's delicious. Guess what? You and me, we made this together. We did it together, you and me. So please come back for another lovely episode of something else we're gonna fix, something special, and guess what? You and me are gonna make this again. Someday, we're gonna make another episode with something different. Hey guys, please like, subscribe, and share to our YouTube channel. I love you. What I gotta say, come back. Bye. Hey guys, I want to show you how to sift the fish batter that we did. This is the fish batter that I had. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this fish batter, right like this, so, and I'm going to put it inside here because it's still got a whole bunch of stuff that I put the fish in. And the stuff that's going in here, I want. And then what's on top, or legs inside of the sifter, I don't want. So I'm like cleaning. So I'm gonna keep doing it until all this is in here. Just get a big old bowl and you just keep doing it. Keep doing it. Because all this good stuff here that's going into this bowl, you're gonna keep. All the stuff that's 
after this is gone, we're gonna discard. I'm gonna show y'all this. Keep doing it. I told you I had a lot. This is after this one. This is gonna be over. Just want to show you all guys. This is the last. <clears throat> this is going to be. See, you can always see the stuff on top. See, that's the stuff you want to discard. You just want to keep the good stuff. And you can use it for another fish fry. Or another seafood fry. Whatever. Which, whichever you want. And it's almost gone. All the good one, all the good stuff from the stuff you want to discard. <laughs> and you're getting all your seasons and everything that you put in there and you, you had and it's just falling down in here. That's the good stuff. Guess what guys? This is the bad stuff. Just take your hand and go around. See all of this? This is the old stuff that was inside of that. So this is no good. This goes in the garbage and this gets pulled back into your bucket. Ready to use. Look at that. Ready to use for another time. So just letting you know, that's how you do it.